Hello! Right, I have a haul for you guys and it's going to be in two parts. So, um, I thought I'd quickly show you what I've been wearing today, um, if you want to know. Um, but as you can see, I have another hat on. Uh, I wear a lot of hats. Um, they're one of my favourite accessories, I think, um, because it is so freaking cold here in Wales. It was freezing today, so cold. Ah, oh, it burns my face. And I'm wearing one of my favourite coats, which I have only recently got. I got this coat in Matalan. It's khaki print with um, these studs on, and I absolutely love it. I wear it like every day. I think I've worn it every day since I've got it. My shirt underneath. I got my shirt a while ago from New Look. My accessories, um, quite minimal. I'm just wearing this um, kind of ring set thing. Um, it goes on this finger and then to this finger. And I'm also wearing this chain. This necklace I got um, in Affleck's Palace, uh, which is in Manchester. I really love it. I think it's really special because it's an actual bullet. Um, and yeah, it's all legitimate military stuff. And it's like, you know, one of the little shops inside Affleck's Palace. So that's cool. Um, and it's just on a gold, you know, one of those bobbly chains, I don't know what you call them. Um, and I, oh, I'm wearing these earrings. So I was wearing these shoes um, and just my jeans, really. So that's my outfit. I will just take my hat and my coat off um, to get a little bit more comfortable. And I will see you in a second. Ooh. Ooh. So I'm back um, with no coat on so I can show you um, the sleeves of this Ooh. okay first thing I bought was this palette and it's the NYC um, individual eyes um, and it's the palette specially created for blue eyes and I do indeed have blue eyes so I thought I need this in my life because I have blue eyes so there's a reason to buy something. It has three kind of eyeshadows, and then it has a highlighter, a primer, and an illuminator. Um, I don't know why I said it like that, but I did. It looks a little bit sweaty, um, I'm not gonna lie. Um, you know how sometimes you get makeup and it's got like almost beads of sweat on the surface? It has that. I'll just wipe it off and try it anyway because I live life on the edge. I will definitely try this out and do a review on my blog probably so look out for that if you're interested. So oh my goodness I finally 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 have um, Lasting Perfection Concealer by Collection 2000. Um, I've been trying to get my hands on this for so so long um, and whenever I go into Superdrug they never have it in in the light uh, so fair number one um and yeah i went into boots as well but the rack thing that they're on they're all like stuffed on in the back um and i'm trying to like i'm literally it's on the floor completely on the lowest thing so i'm like crawling on the floor trying to pull this rack out and i look like an insane person i have waited and i finally have it um so i'm super excited because Every single person um, that I see seems to rave on about this. Um, so I'm just going to give it a little bit of a looky-loo. My goodness, yeah. Yeah, I, so I just did a little swatch on my hand and it looks really, really, really good. So I'm really excited um, to try this. So I will definitely be giving it a review um, on my blog or something like that. So I'm sure I'm going to love it because everyone does, but you know, there's always one. <laughs>
There's an offer on at Superdrug at the moment, and if you spend four ninety nine on any Collection Two Thousand product, then you get a free Extreme Twenty Four Hour Felt Tip um, Liner. And yeah, so I got one free, and I got it in the blue colour. Okay, now for the crazy bit. Um, I am a little bit obsessed with lipsticks at the moment. I just seem to want to collect loads and hoard them like some kind of chipmunk, you know? I want to just hold them all. Uh. Okay, so the first two I have to show you um, are Gosh lipsticks. I've been wanting um, the kind of the nude colour, uh, which is Darling or um, number 134. Um, I've been wanting this for so, 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 so long. It's unbelievable. I've waited for months um, for my super drug to finally get one in. I saw it at the last minute before I was about to pay and I literally like leapt across the floor and like was like mine yeah so the other gosh lipstick that i bought is one that i've also had my eye on for a while and it's this gorgeous purple color and it's in amethyst um or number 131 So those are my two gosh ones. Now we have two Revlon lipsticks. Um, don't think I've got any Revlon lipsticks, so these are my first. I got number uh, 25, which is Skyline Pink. So the camera is not picking up how beautiful um, this really is. Um, it's one of the loveliest nude colours I've ever seen. Um, it is just beautiful. It's kind of like incandescent. It's kind of that, you know, um, really, it's like a highlighter for your lips. Um, it's really, really beautiful. So if you're anywhere near um, a Revlon counter, go and have a look at this one because it is really beautiful. Um, and I got um, number 457 which is Wild Orchid. This just reminds me of like a clip art picture of lipstick, you know, kind of like this colour, I don't know, I just always seem to see cartoon pictures of lipstick looking just like this, I don't know, it's just me probably. Just so so beautiful, a really really beautiful colour and I cannot wait to wear this. Oh. Okay, so now for the ones that I think I'm most excited about um, for many reasons. Firstly, look at the package, I mean come on. Oh. I was first drawn to these for the packaging um, and I know I've said this like so many times but I love packaging oh my god um, packaging can just sell it for me um, but luckily these are great products too so that's a bonus these are both by Bourgeois um, which I'm discovering more and more of and I'm loving more and more of so I think Bourgeois is a really good brand as you know the things I've tried um, but yeah these um, I've seen people talk about these I've seen bloggers blog about these um, I know Louise from Sprinkle of Glitter um, she got one of these quite recently I think um, the lovely shiny ones so since I saw that video I've wanted one of these and I finally got one but we'll start with this one the packaging just oh But what annoys me is they stick these ugly ass stickers on them. You know the kind of the barcode ones? Yeah, they stick like the barcode stickers on them and when you peel it off it leaves all this horrible residue, sticky, ugh. And it's just so frustrating. So I'm going to have to go and lovingly scrub this off um, and try not to damage it. But yeah. Can shops, can you please stop doing that? 
It's just horrible. Ah, uh, honestly, I can't tell you enough how much it infuriates me. These are totally like James Bond esque gadgety beautifulness to me. You have like a button here which you just push upwards. So I'll do that again. I find myself kind of going, freeze. Okay, don't freak out, it's beautiful. But I was a bit like, whoa, when I saw it. But then when I did a swatch, it's gorgeous. It's a crazy, crazy orange, I know, but just bear with me. So yeah, it is a really crazy orange, but um, I'm really excited for spring and summer. I just, I'm getting really adventurous with lipstick and I really hope that I can maybe pull this off with something. I'm definitely thinking of an outfit um, that I can wear this with and yeah, I think it will complement the outfit really well. Now this one, oh my gosh, it's a slightly different packaging, um, you don't have to press a button, you just pop it out, you just pull it out, like that. Um, but the packaging on this, why can't every lipstick be in this packaging, it is so gorgeous. Is that not beautiful? Oh, I want to worship it. I want to just, I just, I can't get enough. Um, I just think it's the most beautiful packaging I've ever seen in my life. It's got rainbows all up in it and it's pink and it's, ooh, ooh, it's just so beautiful. So it's this really, really, really pretty, girly, lovely pink. Um, and it is really, really stunning. Um, so I'll do a little swatchy swatch. So again, the camera really isn't picking up how beautiful um, this one is. Again, it's just such a lovely, lovely colour. Um, and yeah, it's really beautiful. So I'll definitely do um, a blog post with some close-up pictures to try and get um, the true colour. Because, you know, the camera and the lights and the hairness. So that's all the makeup that I bought. Um, I really hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope it gave you some ideas or something. Um, you know, I just hope it brought something to your life. And yeah, don't forget to like, uh, comment, rate, all that good stuff down there. Also, go check out my blog, um, there's a link um, below, and I have lots of other links down below and on my channel page um, with lovely things like you can like me on Facebook, um, you can tweet me, you can follow me, and all that creepy stuff. Thanks for watching, bye! So hey guys, um, I've been, sh why do I say um? <laughs> but one of the bobbly chains, whatever, and stretcher looking ones, um, I have a message, things that I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs>